protest against Iranian regime for eight consecutive night in Ahvaz. Iranian security forces violently confronted Ahvaz citizens who continued to protest against the Iranian regime for the eighth consecutive night. Regime forces used rubber bullets and tear gas bombs. According to some activists, these protests were the largest since protesters erupted around a week ago. Tuesday's protest was held after people headed to the Alovi neighborhood to offer their condolences for the death of 11 people. Golroch Irai went into coma after 60 days of hunger strike. Lady political prisoner Golroch Ibrahimi Irai has gone into coma after some 60 days of hunger strike. She has been transferred to an unknown hospital. Mrs. Irai started her hunger strike on February 3, 2018, 10 days after being unlawfully transferred and banished to Gharchak prison in Varamin in violation of the principle of separation of prisoners' categories. She demands being returned to the women's ward of Evin prison. At least 19 killed and injured by regime agents in southwestern Iran. Four Afghan citizens were killed and 15 others were wounded after Saravan law enforcement agents opened fire at a car carrying Afghan refugees on Monday. Saravan is a city in southeastern province of Sistan and Baluchistan in Iran. Possibility of an imminent execution of a youth who was 15 years old at the time of the crime. Muhammad Aghakhani, the lawyer of Muhammad Kalhor, announced the imminence of his execution. Muhammad Kalhor is a Burujerdi student who was arrested on December 1, 2014, when he was only 15 years old. It is noteworthy that in 2017, at least five child offenders were executed in Iran's prison. Also in January this year, at least three child offenders have been executed in various prisons in Iran. Strike continues in Iran's main sugarcane company. On Wednesday, April 4th, Workers from various parts of the Haftapi Sugar Company, such as the equipment sector, stopped working and said that if their colleagues are not freed and if their demands are not met, the strike will continue. It should be noted that on April 1st, a number of protesting workers were arrested. <laughs>